Hello everyone and uh, welcome back to uh, another one of my uh, traditional wet shaving videos. This is uh, Sean and uh, it's great to be back with you. And uh, tonight I'm going to be uh, featuring a um, triple milled uh, soap. The first time I've uh, done so. What's uh, different about uh, triple milled soaps is that uh, unlike regular the regular kind of soaps, they're uh, much creamier and they last uh, much longer. And um, yeah, very um, packed, full of uh, ingredients. Um, the uh, one in particular I'm going to uh, feature is uh, from Henri et Victoria, the Duc de Santel scent. Yes, uh, we're based out of Quebec. And for the aftershave, it's uh, the same scent, same company. Yeah, it's a, a balm. And uh, the razor I'm going to be using is uh, my Merker 34. And I've uh, placed a, a fresh derby blade inside of it. So um, I, when I'm use, when, whenever I shave with um, soaps, I uh, tend to use mild blades just because I have sensitive skin. Um, if I use anything too aggressive, it uh, leaves a little bit of irritation. So, um, yeah, I'll go with that. And for um, my brush, it'll be my uh, good old uh, synthetic from True Fit and Hill. So I've already got the uh, soap um, warming up under uh, warm water. And I think it should be ready about now. So I'll just go ahead and uh, prep up, rinse the face, and uh, prepare for the shave. So there we go. I've already got the swarming up here. So I'll just apply uh, the, the uh, water inside uh, of this tub and just apply it to my face just for uh, extra slickness. So um, I'll, go ahead, I'll go ahead and start lathering. Mm, it's kind of smoother than uh, I thought it would be. It's probably because I had it uh, soaking in the water. But at least it looks nice and creamy. whole bunch right there. <laughs> All right. Duke de Santel. Sounds uh, very regal. <laughs> okay, so I'll just start applying uh, the lather to my face. Just apply a little bit of uh, water here. Definitely uh, need more water.
Yeah. Even more. <laughs> has a nice fresh scent to it. Not too strong. Well, this does have a hint of sandalwood, lemon, patchouli oil, uh, nutmeg, Take a little bit of time to work this through the skin onto the face for the first pass. But yeah, I think, uh, yeah, this does appear to be a somewhat creamier than uh, the regular soaps I've used before. Definitely feels more luxurious. on my shirt. <laughs> so good. Yeah, can you certainly feel the uh, slickness? more uh, cushioning than uh, what I'm used to with uh, just the regular kind of shaving soap. This is tallow based. Although I saw um, on the ingredients that there is a glycerin as well. So, Henri et Victoria. 
is a uh, Canadian company based out of Quebec. And it's, it was founded in 2014 by Claude Pilon. He holds a uh, background in biochemistry. And he wanted to uh, use his talents to create a uh, brand superior to that of uh, what you would find at grocery stores. It certainly is, this certainly is creamier, I must say. And uh, as I shave, I can really uh, pick up the uh, scent of the soap. It's actually quite, quite pleasant. All right, there we go. First pass done. Yeah, it's looking nice. Okay, so I'll go ahead and rinse off and prepare for the second pass. There we go. Yeah. So far, so good.
이렇게요. 오케이. Second pass. Cross screen. 예, yeah, so, Hungary, a Victoria has a uh, few uh, special scents. Uh, they have lime, uh, cognac in the Cuban cigars. Uh, Fugia. The flowery uh, scented kind. And of course, the uh, product I'm featuring in this video Duke de Santal. Certainly is providing uh, that comfort, that slitness. I can feel it on my face. Now, generally speaking, triple milled soaps are uh, more expensive than uh, the regular kind, but uh, you get what you get what you pay for. With the higher cost comes a higher quality. still feel the hairs. Well, with the uh, third pass, I'll go ahead and uh, clear those off so I can achieve a uh, baby smooth save, shave. One more time.
Yeah, just squeeze this out. Mm-hmm. Nice. Mm-hmm. Very creamy, I must say. Best of all, this is all natural, cruelty-free. So a third pass against the grain. You know, I hope uh, you're all having a wonderful day, having great shaves. Yeah. This, uh, Razor is just cruising through this hair. This is not a particularly a strong scent. You know me, I love uh, scented uh, creams and soaps. However, this is a triple milk soap certainly does the uh, job when it comes to protecting the face, the skin against irritation. I feel none whatsoever. Yeah, nice and smooth. Mm. 
Although, my niece says shirt is really messy. Yeah, I think I'll have to invest in more of these uh, triple milled uh, soaps in the future to try out. They're just getting at those trouble spots there. Very nice. Okay, so I'll just go ahead and uh, rinse off and uh, apply the aftershave and give my final remarks. Incredibly smooth, yeah, quite slick, quite fresh, yeah, I think I'm, overall I'm generally uh, impressed with this uh, triple milled shaving soap, yeah. I'll definitely have to try out the uh, other kinds from uh, this particular brand. My loved ones uh, might be uh, saying, oh, Sean, why are you spending so much money on all these uh, shaving creams and aftershaves and soaps and these uh, razors? Why can't you just be uh, content with uh, only uh, settling for one? Well, it's because um, I'm spending all that money for you, the viewers. I want you to be informed of uh, what kind of uh, creams uh, to use. So that way you don't have to make uh, any mistakes. All right, time for the aftershave. Duc de Santal, a balm. Okay, just apply evenly to the face. Just massage it gently into the skin to close the pores. And there. Just, uh, Patry off the uh, excess cream, lotion, whatever you want to call it, 
And that's it. We're done. Yeah, so overall, a nice product. Um, I think it, it, the uh, triple milled uh, shaving soap provides uh, the extra comfort to uh, one's face while shaving. And uh, there's, I don't, there's no irritation on my uh, face at all, which um, I'm really thankful for. Um, yeah, so I think I'll continue using uh, this triple milled uh, soap, soap <laughs> uh, in uh, future shaves. And uh, I think I'll try out uh, more of uh, the uh, soaps from uh, Henri et Victoria. So, um, just to summarize, I've uh, this was the uh, soap that I used for today's shave. The uh, Duke de Santel uh, triple mill soap from uh, Henri et Victoria, based uh, out of Quebec, Canada. Uh, Henri et Victoria Duke de Santel aftershave balm for my brush, the uh, synthetic True Fit and Hill, and the razor, my Merco 34 equipped with a fresh derby blade. Okay, so um, I do hope you found this uh, video to, to be uh, rather helpful. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my uh, channel. And uh, I do thank you for uh, taking the time to watch this video today. And uh, I will be uh, certainly uh, looking forward to uh, seeing you again in uh, the future. Okay, so I'll just close out by saying peace, much love, and namaste. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. Take care. God bless. Bye now.